was a lovely event. I just can't believe so many amazing people came and celebrated, stayed right to the end, and they're enthusiastic and so forth. It was, it was moving, I'm telling you, and it just shows you the strength of the Philippine economy and how strong the future will be in this country. Lots of smiling uh, Filipinos here. You know, warm people and warm smiles. And I just see that there's a big opportunity for, for people here to move up their lives. And so we're doing a small bit to help that, we think, by promoting Philippines to the world as a premier destination for investment and locators. Come to Philippines, hire people, they're good people to work with, and you'll do well. That's what we're trying to, to say is, is our message. Well, pleasant people. I can tell you it is, I wouldn't say rare, but it's not as easy to find as it is here. Pleasant people who will work hard. And I think there's two main things, and that is pleasant people who will work hard and they don't mind learning. I guess number three, that's the key asset Philippines has is the people and the, the characteristics of people here. We want to have both co-mingling together. So you see the, the ones who have done amazing things their whole lives. So they're a great example and inspiration to everyone. And you also want to get the, the younger people up. You know, the people who have the companies that they've just started or maybe they're a few years old. Get them up on the stage so that other people are introduced to them and get to know what they do. So it helps their business, helps them to grow so they can hire people, they can expand and, and so forth. This is good for the economy and good for everybody. So that's the, the purpose, to, to, to mix both the, the, the lifetime contributors who've really done great things for the country over a long period of time and the new companies to inspire them. Well, it'll be our 10th year, so it'll be a big one. And we're going to have to work, and I, I really don't know what we're going to do yet, but it's going to be bigger and better, and uh, we can hardly wait to that time, and we'll look forward to seeing you there with us. So thank you to everyone who participated in Asia CEO Awards 2018. It was a fantastic event. We had premier heroes, Tessie C. We had former Governor Tatanko with us. We had so many leaders and, and companies with us. It was just so exciting. So thank you very much, everyone. We'll see you again next year. Uh, of course, uh, congratulations to uh, Rebecca and uh, Richard. This is really a fantastic event, and the Philippine Business and News is very honored to be part of this prestigious event, the Oscars of the business. We're in, uh, we are able to give awards to deserving leaders, the young CEOs, the CEOs who make a positive difference. Uh, all the winners, you all deserve this because you know how the process went before you were able to get this award. You had to pass through an eye of the needle. And I hope that you will not rest on your laurels. You will continue to shine, you will continue to cascade and become beacons to your people, to your team. So mabuhay and God bless. God bless and have a great night tonight. Thank you very much.